Okay, welcome back. We got a really good band here today. Blue Esther Cult. They just released a new album. This is their first album in 19 years. Um, a really good album. I'm going to go through it track by track. It's I like it a lot. A mixed bag. But let me get started. Here's the first track. Okay, first track. Boom. Right out the box. Metal, heavy metal track. I really love this riff. Really hard riff. Um, really good stuff. It sounds maybe like a Judas Priest kind of Saxon kind of track. I really like it. They have a video for it. Pretty cool. Has some cowbell in it. So come check, go check that out on YouTube. But um, again, really great opening to the album. Okay, the next track is called Box In My Head. Um, this one I like a lot. Mid-tempo rocker. Reminds me of that like early 90s alternative sound. Um, again, it's a pretty cool rocker. Again, another strong track. I like it a lot. Okay, the next track is called Tainted Blood. Again, good track. A little slower, this one. Starts off with a pretty cool, you know, guitar riff. Um, reminiscent of a classic Blue Oyster Cult style from like the early 70s. Again, another strong track on the, on the record. Okay, the next track, Nightmare Epiphany. Another mid-tempo rocker. Reminiscent of the late 70s Blue Oyster Cult sound. Um, again, another decent track on the album. Um, we, we got a lot of good stuff here. Okay, the next track is called Edge of the World. This one's uh, a rocker. I, I like it a lot. It has some real hard guitars, a very really good hard rock sound. Um, again, another strong album on the track. I, think, I like everything on this album, but I mean, this is one of the good ones. Okay, next song is The Machine. We've got some uh, hard rock tune here. Um, it reminds me of like some like early 80s. Um, I would go with hard rock, not exactly metal. Um, rock and tune here. Again, if you're a fan of the band, you like it, reminiscent of their old sound. Uh, good stuff here. Okay, this next track is called Train True Lenny Song. Um, this one starts out, it sounds very country, it picks up a little bit, it goes uh, into like a rock, southern rock kind of song, um, good song, not exactly my cup of tea, but again, if you're a fan of uh, country or southern rock, you'd probably like the song a lot. Okay, the next track is The Return of St. Cecilia. Again, throwback to the 80s, hard rocking, maybe into hair metal. Reminds me of like early 80s White Snake. Has some pretty cool guitars on it, cool riffs. Um, good song, like a lot. Okay, the next track, Stand and Fight. This is the heaviest metal song on this album. Um, it goes into like a Judas Priest territory, almost even a Metallica Black Album kind of sound. I would really love to see Metallica cover this. I know they're big fans of this band and it would really be a great cover for them. Um, so for, for you metalheads, this is the song for you. Great stuff. Okay, the next track is called Florida Man. Um, it's a nice bluesy track, you know, nice mid-tempo rocker. Uh, again, kind of throwback to their old, uh, maybe late 70s style. Um, the song is about, I think it's like a meme or something about the Florida Man. But again, a pretty cool song. Okay, this next song is The Alchemist. This is a great track. It could be the next Don't Fear Your Reaper. Classic sound uh, from the Spectres era. Um, classic Blue Oyster Cult sound. It's dark, 
a brooding sound. It's really, really great stuff here. One of the best, probably the best on the album. Also, there's a video of it. Uh, check it out. Look it up on YouTube. Okay, this next track, there's only three more. It's called Secret Road. A good mid-tempo rocker. Just imagine a band of these like 60-year-old dudes playing like some outdoor show. Um, that's the kind of sound I can imagine. Um, again, a pretty cool song. Again, we're getting to the end almost. Okay, this next song, There's a Crime. A very up-tempo song. Uh, hard rocking, a lot of uh, guitars, um, really good sound, upbeat. Uh, again, it's almost the closer of the album. Um, great song. Okay, the final song is called Fight. Starts off with pretty cool rock riff, maybe a little reminiscent of like Pink Floyd, David Gilmore. Um, again, it's a mid tempo rock track. Uh, Reminiscent of the 80s uh, Blue Oyster Cult sound. Really good, um, really good ending to the album. Okay, so that's the end. 14 tracks. Running time is about an hour, so it's a really good album. Um, who knows, maybe it could be their last album, but hopefully we'll get something else out of them sometime in the future. It was a really good mixed bag, a lot of variety in, in the album. So I'm going to rank it an 8 out of a 10. Hmm. Okay, thanks for watching. Um, if you like my videos, uh, remember, subscribe, give me a thumbs up, uh, ring the bell if you need some alerts of when I upload. I'm going to try to upload maybe every day, every other day. But I'm going to try to upload as much as I can. I have a new Facebook page, JC Rock and Metal Review. Look it up. I'll link it somewhere at some point. Um, other than that, thank you for watching. See you next time.